Hello and welcome to the Skinny Fort Lauderdale. I'm Melissa, warm and sunny today. After failing to regain the confidence of his peers on Capitol Hill, Congressman Trey Radel is resigning. The self-proclaimed hip-hop conservative from Fort Myers is stepping down just six weeks after pleading guilty to cocaine possession and entering rehab. If you live in Fort Lauderdale and you're tired of having to drive for miles for a midnight run to Walmart, you're in luck. Lauderdale is steps away from getting its own super center. The city signed off on it last week. The $100 million project goes before the county commission tomorrow. It'll take up several blocks of Broward Boulevard just west of 95. They hope to break ground later this year and have stores open by the end of next. Royal Caribbean cutting short a 10-day Caribbean cruise after more than 600 passengers and crew members were sickened by the norovirus often known as a gastrointestinal nightmare. The ship will return to its Jersey port Wednesday for a massive scrub down and sanitizing. Lauderdale's airport making the top 10 in the nation for most guns intercepted. Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International ranks ninth with 45 guns taken in last year. Atlanta's airport was tops with over 100 firearms confiscated. First class postage going up today. The cost of a stamp rising three cents to 49 cents. That's the Skinny Fort Lauderdale for Monday, January 27th. We'll see you on showrodeo.com.